Good morning, everyone. It's a beautiful Sunday, and as you can see, it's kind of a beautiful day here. Um, well, not between the snow and the whatever, but um, I just wanted to talk about energy. I'm not talking about gas or propane, or I'm talking about the energy within you, um, the collective, the power that you hold, and um, you need to protect it because now, more than ever, the dark side is. It, it wants to drain you. It does. If you're ever around people, friends or whatever, and you feel drained after being around them, that's what it is. It's, it's, it's um, energy vampires. They're out there. They're the person you talk to, and when you're done, you got a headache, and it usually takes you a couple days to detox. So basically, I realized my whole life, I've been other people's battery and um, dump disposal, and I'm tired of that done with it I've broken contact with pretty much everybody I know family friends well you you know granted what they are literally I just don't contact people no more and there's a reason I realized in my research through es 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 esoteric and everything else uh, like for example YouTube when I started looking at the tarot card readers and stuff and just kind of going through that I did it scientifically I I didn't plug into individual readers what I would do is I would go down the list for Taurus and I would see what they're talking about like their title was and the weird thing was all their titles would be almost the same and it's like they all got into a little conference together at the morning and said okay this is what we're going to talk about but it was the universe it was a collective it was energy it was my energy and I was putting it out there and so are you and we all got to tap into it figured out but um anyway so that was one interesting aspect but I also found out that you can you can be attacked psychically through the internet, through your phone, um, through messages. If somebody messages you and you send a message back, that's the link. See, if you don't, if you don't open the message, oh, don't open the email. Because if you open the email, that gives them that link to you. It's odd. I didn't realize it. it took me a long time. For example, what's up? That app, okay? Day one, just because I'm curious and I'm a single guy and I just want to see what's up, right? I didn't realize it was that sleazy. The first person that hit on me was throwing out naked photos of herself and stuff. And I was like, what the hell, dude? I just wanted to say hi. You know, I thought that was maybe a dating site. And then when I wouldn't send her money to come see me, it got really nasty. And she started talking about Santeria and her grandma was going to curse me. And I was like, yeah, because I wouldn't send her money to come hump me. Basically, it was a scam, but still, evil exists, people. And so, yeah, I don't, <laughs> that was my one experience. I was done. I was like, no. Nope. And there was, oh, one other experience I got was I thought it was a dating site, and some lady wanted me to be her um, sub, her pet. Adorable, but I'm nobody's pet, baby. But, yeah, that was cute. So, yeah, I don't date. Um, yeah. So, anyway, protect your energy. Don't, you know, even eye contact can be something extremely personal especially if you're empathic. So just protect your energy, um, love yourself. And I feel the energy really negative today. Um, and I got, I've been attacked, somebody's messing with my money. Yeah, people can do that too, just psychically, their intentions. It's really fucked up, but people can do that. You'd be amazed what people could do psychically, especially when they don't like you or they're envious of you or they don't want you to succeed. I'm, I'm a homeless, just balls out in the middle of nowhere. I don't know what I'm doing, don't know where I'm going. And people hate me for it. I don't know. I'm scared shitless half the time, not knowing where I'm going to go, where I'm going to go, if I'm going to go, if I'm going to have the money to go there. But I don't care. Where I was was shit. Where I was was absolute just purgatory. It was like slow death. So I figured if I'm going to if I'm gonna go, I'm going to go on my terms. That's it. My energy. And I'm in my power. And once you step in your power, that's when they, that's when the evil really jumps on you. That's when the dark side steps up. Because I'm about to get my power. Something good is about to happen to me because I can feel the negative energy. Look at that hawk. You're awesome. Love you. I'm feeling it, but they're not going to win. What's mine is mine. And the universe gave it to me as a gift. You can't take that away. And you do not want to mess with the universe. I'm just saying. Anyway, love you people. Have a wonderful day. Remember, protect your energy. It's all you got. It's all you got, and it's important because it keeps you sane and it gets you where you need to go, your destiny. Love you guys. Have a wonderful day. Love and light be.